Hey everyone, Shabby Gamer here, and welcome back to some more Tavern Tycoon. Now on to scenario number four. I've tried this once so far, and I had some massive, massive lag spikes. I'm hoping I may have sorted the issues out, but um, hopefully this time it'll work. I'm getting a lot more frames per second on fraps now, so that's not a bad thing. Um, this is a bit harder, this one, uh, mainly because you don't get a lot of staff, so it's pretty tricky. Here we go. Be prepared to face big, ugly business. Do what you have to do to run this low reputation tavern into success. Value your staff and hire them as early as you can as they are hard to come by. Your objective is 800 rep, 80,000 tavern value and keep your finance above 40,000 gold which is a big one. Remember that you will be fired if your tavern goes under or if reputation drops even further. Good luck. Okay. Okay, so first thing I want to buy this straight away. Because again, first thing we want to do is purchase the research workshop. Um, and get that from running. Now this uh, building back here will eventually be solely four rooms, I think, is the best way forward. And then all the other stuff, um, I want to say rooms, obviously rooms are a normal thing in the game. But this, um, there for rest room, not rest rooms, um, what's the word? Guest rooms, that's the word I'm trying to think of, right? Guest rooms. Right, I'm going to go for the kitchen in this corner. I didn't, I didn't the other corner last time, I just want to try it. It's a bit different, we're going to put the door there. Put that there and that there, great. I might put the bars in this top corner actually. I'm just trying to change it around from the last time I did it just to try and give myself something different to look at. But um, I'm going to knock out two bars straight off the bat. Don't really want to put it all the way in the corner. Um, let's put one there, then I can know I can put one straight next to it then as well. Then I've got that little gap in the corner. Um, also going to want um, a couple of tables. Let's get four tables. Um, Let's get a little bit of space, then we can put three across there. Oh, that's not gone well, has it? How has that ended up in the middle of the other table? That has not gone well, has it? Right. Relocate that. Okay, let's put that there then. Um, so we need a bartender 202. Wow. But I think we have to hire the staff before other staff becomes available. 227, wow. Let's rename the bar to our standard The Ragged Flagon. Right, we're open. We are open. What do we need to do? We need a staff room. We need rest rooms. Then I think we are on top then, I believe. And we've got the research going. Let's make sure that we're researching the correct thing. We just want to go for new recipes. I don't know if this is a bigger problem on this one, but last time obviously it was a massive issue, right? Let's continue building rooms. We want a guest room here. A rest room, even not a guest room. Um, quite near to the bar. Um, let's go for one, two, three, and four. It's not the best designed room, that is it really, but it'll do. And then a staff room. Yes, fits in there nicely. Let's put it there just in case I want to try and put a room right up against it. And then that can go there. Right. So I think we're up and running now. We've got the basics in there. Getting cold feet. Um, after many nights of consideration and reconsideration, I have offered you a job that can be classified as difficult. Obviously, I expect you to succeed, and should you fail, you will be fired. But hey, big opportunity. Make it count. Your objective is 800 rep, 80,000 tavern value, and keep your finance above 40,000 gold. Go strong. Also, I have intel that people are not interested in having a job down there. So I'd value whoever is interested in actually having a job. Could be wrong, so don't count on me. Okay. And he wants to come make an a inspection as well. That's fine. January doesn't really matter because we're not making money yet. Um, that doesn't matter. Giving your name, bar a name, great. World issue, getting fired. Okay. That's just what happens. Okay. So, we're not looking too bad. We need to get another maiden. The one who's going to work actually on the tables like so we've got we want to get another couple maintenance if we can doing this and um, we want to build some rooms now this is a an awkward shaped building so we have to go four by three that way can i build no i can't build three no it's eight along that is so it doesn't matter where i put the door so it's gonna have like a like a corridor the whole way down this room uh, down this um of two wide now, one thing I noticed when I did the last little run, it didn't last very long on the last one because the because the lag just uh, the lag basically took control. 
um, is that the rooms were getting a lot more uh, people staying in them. So I might try and do um, start off with like four off the bat and just see how we get on. Um, and then if it does go well, then we can uh, look to have more. Right, we do need obviously to build a gym and an arcade study as well. Don't know if I'm going to bother too much with a spa because it's incredibly expensive. Now, I have seen something new that I didn't notice before. Oh, we got Lord Peter. No, we haven't. No, Lord Peter's still wandering around. And uh, one thing I noticed in the policy is that Lord Peter? Nope. That's more boring stuff. Um, oh, I'm going to stop reading that now because I'm not. Um, right, now you can do this now. You can change to wait and leave. So because we haven't got a spa, I can tell people to leave rather than waiting for it, which is a good thing for us to do. Um, let's boost these prices up a little bit. Uh, not too much that we're going to take a massive hit on reputation, but enough to um, to get us a bit of extra money. Let's get an extra handyman in. And then let's get a reception desk, which can hopefully go there, can it? It can go there. Oh, that's nice fitting. And that means we need a clerk. We've got one for 137. There you go. Right. Was Lord Peter happy? Good job. He was happy. Excellent. He wants a raise. Let's give him a raise for now, then. Good job, 1500 gold and 20 rep, which is good. So now we need a um, gymnasium and an arcane study. Let's build these down here. Um, I did notice last time when I was playing this through quickly earlier, when it crashed on me, that you do get a lot of knights and a lot of wizards coming to visit. So it is worth um, buying the extra materials in here, I think. Um, let's go another bench press against that wall. I can't do a bench press. I can do a bench press there. And another exercise. No. Oh, crap. I pressed that button. It won't let me do anything, will it? I did this earlier, and you can't. But I put an exercise mat down, and then I can't proceed because I've got that. What can I do? No. There's no space for another bench press. Let me get rid of it. Can I press delete? Escape? Nope. Literally, I'm going to have to relocate all furniture. That is so annoying. Right. Let's put that there. Let's put you there. Another training dummy. There. Another bench press. Oh. Right, it's fine. It can stay in the middle of the room. It can't stay in the middle of the room because I can't put the other mat down. Oh, this is annoying now. This is annoying. Right, relocate furniture again. I hope this isn't costing us money. Because that would be really frustrating if it is. Right. Right, we can do this this time. Let's just stop rushing. Let's not misclick anymore. Right, I didn't want to do a mat yet. I want to do a, um, a bench press, to be honest. Put a mat there. Bench press against that wall. Another exercise mat. I can't fit another exercise mat in, so... <sighs> this is just annoying. I want to just proceed. I don't want to build the exercise mat. I can't, I can't fit one in. It went... I saw it go red there for a second. Right. 84th time lucky. Let's do this. Right. One of those. Two of those. Oh, three of those. So one of you. Another one of you. Right, that's a gym done. I'm not messing around with it anymore. That's fine. Hopefully the arcane study will be a bit easier. I don't know why I struggled so much with that. I'll tell you. Right. Six by six for an arcane study. Go right over there. That can go there. We need the room stage needs a big bit of space. But then study desk, this is where it's all at because these gives us a lot of uh, extra spaces for wizards, which is a good thing. Right, that's a lot. Right, that's, a one down. Okay, that's a lot. Right, so we got them two down now as well. And this might come as some surprise. That's a spam, isn't it? Okay. Lord Peter wants to make a regular visit. That's fine. March. We made a lot of gold. That's because of me messing on the rooms, I think, isn't it? Group reservation for 17 wizards. That's great. We've got space for you now in our arcane wizardry room, whatever it's called. Hey, Rise. Okay, we'll give you the raise. We'll give you the raise. A group reservation for 19 nights. April. We made 5,000 gold, but we spent 12,000. So, 
Obviously, that's me um, putting the room down, picking the room back up, putting the room down, picking the room back up again. It's a bit of a false economy, really, isn't it? So we've got a lot of people coming now. Oh, we obviously didn't give uh, that maid a pay rise in time when she's leaving. Okay. 148. Is that it's the maiden who should be out here? Okay, it is. Let's put you out here then. I'm thinking we're going to need an extra bar with all these people about to come in. Don't want those. Let's get a fireplace. Let's get a pot plant and let's get a performance there. Let's just go balls to the wall here. Let's put you there. Let's put the fireplace. That's a good position for the fireplace, that is. Potted plant there. And a performance stage. Yeah, it's going to be tricky, isn't it? Let's get the performance stage near. Ideally, with the fireplace is where the performance stage should be. Because it's now going to go... If I put the performance stage like right here, as people come by, that'd be fine, wouldn't it? Might do a fireplace near the door as well, actually, because these seem to they got they they give people a boost in happiness. So if we do this like there, as people are walking in and out, or there, no, there. It's gonna have to go there. So as people are coming in and out, it gives them a little boost in happiness, right? It's quite a lot of people waiting, that's because we've got no bartenders at the moment. So let's drop a bartender in. Because this bartender is currently in the staff room. He's happy now though. We'll drop him down there as well. So that should give us two bartenders on the go. A couple of kids to get rid of. That should now give people places to sit at the bar, which it has. Good. Um, we're doing okay at the moment. Right, the maiden's wandering around where she should be. Okay. So having the um, the pot plant as well gives us a better eco-friendliness, which is something the Lord Peter likes. Talking to Lord Peter, he wants to make a visit, that's fine. In May, we didn't, we made half our amount of money that we spent, which is not too bad actually. Is there another maiden available? There is, for 90. Let's drop her in to there. Again, you see the rooms, three out of the four are currently being used and there's somebody making his way to the next guest room. So I think we can build another one. I'm going to build one. I'm going to try and be cheeky with the space that I've got available here. So I'm going to go for this shape, and I think that might help us because we've got 4, 4, 3 is 11, and this is 18 wide. So we've got another 7 spaces, so I'll, do another, I'll have to do another big one. I'm sure we can squeeze them in. It's not going to look pretty, but it's going to do the trick. Right, the wizards are all at the bar. We're going to need another bartender. If we can get one, we can get another bartender. So we can. So it means there's basically no choice in staff, basically, so it's not too bad. You're leaving for plus nine. Excellent. So reputation's going up to 183, which is good. And that's more tutorial stuff. We don't need that. We can just unsubscribe to that, can't we? Right, so we go. People are now making their way to sit down at this bar as well, which is good. This one will start to clear out as well. All these people. Problem is, I took um, two big groups of people, didn't I? A group of wizards and a group of knights at the same time. Um, so everyone's sort of coming at the same time, which is not a good thing. You are stuck. You are... that's not good, is it? Can I pick you up? I can't pick you up, but you are stuck. Um, uh, that's not good. Hopefully that's just a one-off, but... I don't know quite what's going on there. Is the restroom too close to the wall? I know he's moving, he's moving. That's good. I was getting a bit worried there for a second, but he is moving now. So spaces are opening up the bar and people are making their way there, which is good. Um... All again, all of our rooms are, are being used, which is good, but I can't build another one now until this is gone. I don't know if we're having any problems with... with um, let's have a look. Well, he's obviously getting the food he wants. He's having a whole roast chicken, so that's not too bad. We need your support. No, thank you. I'm not interested. Um, June, we're going to make a decent amount of money again. Um, you are... Uh, wait for a seat at the bar. Wait for a seat at the bar. Okay, I think, well... I was about to say we're not doing too bad, but there's another bartender now gone for his break. Let's drop another bartender in here. Two bartenders gone for his break at the same time. Wow, that's uh, not good, is it? Lord Peter was happy. 20 rep and 1,500 gold. Excellent. Well, let's uh, get some more people in here now, then. Now that we've got the extra barman. That should mean that people can move to the bar and get a drink now. Why aren't they? Right, there's one guy sitting there. Come on, people. These two are resting. They're still pretty tired. You're not as bad, I don't think. 
you're on your way there now as well. Literally three of the four bartenders are on their way right now. You are on your way back out. You can go in that one. Let's kill that rat. How many um, handymen do we have at this point in time? We've got two handymen, but at the moment they're not doing a very good job, are they? Let's get one onto sunglasses, because that's going to reduce the chances of them asking for a pay rise. Um, which is always a good thing. Right. Right, right, right. So you're leaving with a plus eight. So reputation-wise, we're doing actually really well. You're on your way back out. Let's speed you up and drop you straight in the uh, in the bar. All right, that's good. We should get a fourth bar. Why not? I've got four members of staff now, so I might as well just have the fourth bar there, might I? All right, so you can go. You're going back. Why are you going back to the? Where are you going? Okay, you can go to there then. Okay, that should uh, offer enough spaces now at the bar for everyone. It's oh, quite a nice little layout, actually. I'm quite enjoying this little layout. Um, how's the tavern going? Well, Pete wants to come back again, which is fantastic. And you're going to keep bringing your 1500 gold a time. And I think we were pretty close to making a profit that time about Lord Peter's money, to be honest. I don't know if we actually need these maidens. Um, we're not having any problems with food at the moment, are we? Which was a big one last time. Research and early. If you can't produce what they've ordered in the short run, you'll lose reputation. Unhappy guests give you bad feedback. Right, so people are now waiting for the reception desk and waiting for rooms. Which is uh, tricky, isn't it? Let's put the price on rooms up there a bit, because we are we could be making more money out of this thing, couldn't we? Let's do that. So all these people waiting for rooms now. Wow, they are, aren't they? Waiting for restroom, you are, but you should be okay. Walking around, we're at gymnasium. Okay. So there's a lot of people waiting for guest rooms, and I'm wondering whether this is much point to this at the moment. It's going to be a while till we actually get our next recipe. At the moment, our rep's going up. We're not suffering as badly from this. I don't really want to put any guest rooms in here. There's a rat to kill. That man was just sick on a rat. That is not nice, is it? So Lord Peter's here. He's looking okay. He's looking happiness. I think that pot plant has given us all the eco-friendliness we could ever need. Um, yeah, that's true. Yeah, we're struggling with guest room, uh, restrooms, aren't we? They're all currently in use, but I think there shouldn't be that many people waiting for the restroom at once. So you're waiting for a seat at the bar. Right. I think we've got a problem again here. Then let's save and reload, because at the moment everyone's um it looks like people waiting for the bar or their queuing system is not working correctly which has happened quite a few times to us now but luckily if we do save and reload it does tend to reset them and it will put them back to where they need to go hopefully anyway that's the that's the year that's the hope winter is coming is that a game of thrones reference winter is coming isn't it i'm not gonna lie i'm not 100 percent sure and um, i've not really watched much a Game of Thrones. I'm tendly, I tend to be someone who likes the blitz through thing. So if it's not, um, if it's not finished, I generally won't touch it. Then when it's finished, I'll watch for it all in just like a massive binge. And uh, that's the sort of thing I probably do with Game of Thrones was finished because the sort of thing I probably would like. Obviously playing Skyrim and obviously playing games like this as well. It's the sort of thing I probably would like. But um, yeah, that's not really something I've got into as yet. I will, I will watch at some point. Right, here we go. Yeah, look, as soon as you log back in, everybody just goes storming to the bar. So they're all sitting down now, waiting for rest, uh, going to restroom, going to restroom. So that has really um, fixed a lot of the issues we had. A couple of kids there sneaking in. Right, so the bars are now full. You are all waiting for guest rooms and so forth. You know what, I'm just going to get rid of this. It might be a really stupid idea, but at the moment, we're not losing rep by not having the, rep by not having the stuff they want, so... Let's relocate furniture and get rid of room. Uh, monthly report, Mark. Um, Lord Pete wants to visit, that's fine. Um, August, we didn't make any money. And this is brand new now, so we just start new. Um, we load up the save again, haven't we? So I want to hire another handyman. And I want to fire uh, a couple of maidens, because I don't need that many of them. I can get rid of you quite easily. 
and I'll get rid of you quite easily. And I might get 202 for that bartender. Is there another bartender available? If there is, I'll just get rid of that one and I will hire a new one. I can't click on the right button to save my life, can I? Like staff. Bartender is one of 46, so let's drop you in. And then let's go to no, management. And let's get rid of you because you are very expensive. Right, let's give bonuses to get the sunglasses back on. That should stop the um, the request for um, what do we call it? Pay rises. That's the word I'm looking for. Now guest rooms. So I want four by three. Because at the moment, I reckon we can sell all these guest rooms out and have um, have a, a chunk of money coming in. Really, seems to be a good way forward. I've, I've heard rumours that you have to have a certain amount of receptionists per guest rooms. Um, I don't know if that's correct or not. I'm sure we'll soon find out, won't we, if, um, if any of these rooms are not booked out. Oh, I've really bugged up this one, haven't I? It doesn't matter. It's hidden around the corner. You can't see it. It's going to trigger a lot of people, I know, but it's fine. Don't worry about it. Right, so this is... It, again, it's not the best setup, but I suppose it is the best setup because it's the one that's going to fit the most rooms in. That can be 4x4 now, then, can't it? And like so. So that gets us all the rooms now. That hopefully should get us clearing through these people pretty quickly. Um, Lord Peter's on his way, is he? I think. Uh, September. How do we do in September? We made 3,950 gold. So I'm feeling something hard to get rid of that room, isn't it? Okay. So he just has asked for something we don't have. And he's going to leave and give us a minus. Now he's waiting for the spa. We haven't got a spa. I'm sure I changed that on the policy, did I? Spa. No, spa, leave. If you do want to use the spa, just leave. So they're leaving minus one, minus one, minus one. Okay, that's strange. Keep it up. Lord Peter's happy, though. 1,500 gold and 20 rep. We've not had a bad one from Lord Peter so far. Minus 19, minus one. We just lost a bartender. Did I not see his um, pay increase request early enough? No, that was the one I sacked. Okay. So again, are we having troubles here? Reception desk, restroom, gymnasium. But gymnasium's empty. Why are you waiting? Ah. Oh. Right. Let's try and save and reload again because we're having problems again, aren't we? If it continues, we'll have to leave this scenario for now and then. Um, and then try again after another update. It was supposed to all be fixed with this update, but I think there's still uh, quite a few issues ongoing. And again, you, you can't moan it. It's, it's, a, it's an alpha game or a beta game, whatever you want to call it. And um, it's still building. This is an alpha game, isn't it? Yeah, it's still being built and the guy's working on it pretty hard. He's releasing updates every week or two. And he's obviously spending a lot of time on it. So you can't moan at him. Um, but... Yeah, it, I don't think quite the, the patch that was released the other day has fixed all the problems like he thought it had, but we'll see. I think saving it and reloading it seems to do the trick at the moment. It seems to refresh everyone's list and they end up going and doing what they need to do. Hopefully, we had a few people there waiting for the restroom, waiting for the gymnasium and so forth. So hopefully this will move everybody to where they need to go. Of course, there are certain things like guest rooms we can't do any difference with because... Um, does that fix anyone? Waiting for gymnasium. It's empty. The gymnasium is empty. Why are you not using it? Waiting for restroom, which is empty. Gymnasium. Restroom. No, we definitely have a problem, don't we? Uh, we've got something going in the arcane. So how are the guest rooms looking? We've got... Only one's got people in at the moment. I think we have to wait and... Uh, only one person can see the receptionist at once, can't they? <laughs> Thank you.